Welcome back to Skyrim, I am Raytag and this is the Dawn Guard questline. Alright, it's time to get into the Dwarven Ruins. Oh, excuse me ladies, come on. I want to get through here. We have got to find this scroll. Alrighty, let's get to it. Um, hmm. Actually, I think what I'll do... Eleanor. I'm right behind you. I'd like to give you something. What do you want me to carry? I want to give you... Where is it? Uh, it's... Ah, uh, uh, yes, here we are. Travel lantern. You take that and hopefully you'll wear it. Let's get going then. Or how about... I've I think, got your back. Ah, uh, about your lantern. Right. Keep it close at hand, wearing it at the front, like the path... You lead, I'll follow. All right. So we've got an extra light source with us. Hopefully it's not going to blind the crap out of me. Ooh, I'll take that. Search that barrel. I'll take those as well. Yes, it's a bit of uh, extra light. Although it's very blinding with the snow. Um, ooh, danger hearts. Lots of danger hearts. Take those. Search the chest. Uh, I won't take the great sword. We want to keep our weight down. All right. Yep. Damn these people. That's a loot. It's not a named loot. Uh, I think I might leave that book. Let's just keep pressing on down this dungeon. Rather get through this ASAP. Hello, what's this? Ooh. Where is it? I know you were trying to keep it for yourself, Chizar. You always try to keep it for yourself. No, I th there's got to be more stupid. Shut up. Shut up. Don't like me, Chizar. I think he's uh, missing his schooner. Alright, um, let's see, what have we got around here? Got a dwarven spider. I'll just take your ore. Won't take the scrap. Keep pushing on through. No, nothing here. Now, this is a Dwemer place. We've got to be wary for a Dwemer things. Namely, popping out of these tubes. Because that's where they like to... Uh... There we go. Okay, that spider. I'll take your oil. Right, moving right along. It's definitely a bit dark in here. Eleanor, where are you? Bring your light. Oh, here's another one. Take that. Shields. Alright. Oh, yeah. I'll, I'll live with that gyro. If I have to, I'll get rid of it. Actually, uh, do I want to spend my level up now? Balls to it. Yes, I do. Um, what shall I increase? Stamina again? Yep, why not? Extra stamina is always handy. Right, and I'm going to increase my one-handed. Oh, or my block. Um, I might just increase my block. If I can keep my block skill up and ready, the more chance my lady is going to be able to do damage. Hmm, it's a bit laggy here. Amethyst, soul gem. Getting a lot of soul gems. Ah, potion. Coin purse. What's in the chest? Ooh. Jewelry. Right. Yes, yeah, definitely having light sources in. Ooh, ooh. That scared me. Hey, where do you think you're going? Ha ha ha. 
I think he took exception to the light. Didn't like that very much. Well, I can live with that. Alright, um, hopefully Eleanor's got a, a decent amount of arrows on her. What? Who is this, brother? Another of the smooth skins looking for food? But this one wasn't trying oh to Never should have come here. Jada, you are <laughs> toast. <laughs> Take that. Jada. Jada and Jada. Jada. He didn't have anything on him. You are a fool. A fool you were. I'll take your gold. Your foolish gold. Anything else in this place? No, nothing interesting. Alright, get me all the healing spell out. Just top up. And push right on. Actually, I might just check items. My weapon, I'm pretty sure. Oh no, it's got uh, enough in it. There's another coin purse. Alright, what's this? Ah, another journal. Um, Ill-fated expedition again. Alright, I'll take your soul gem. Maybe I should start trying to be a bit more sneaky. What do you think? We'll try it? Might as well. Alright, it's dark. Apart from this well lit area. Is there anything else going to jump out at me? There's oil on the ground. And... I was right. Take that. Shields. Shields at the ready. Aha. Bugger. Oh, that was close. Do we have two of them? I might have to go to third person view, I reckon. Refill. Back to shields. Oh, dwarven bolts. Dwarven bolts. Ah, I wonder. I wonder indeed. Uh, okay, yep, that was that one. Dwarven bolts. I wonder if they go into my crossbow. Hmm, I wonder. Alright. There's a few pistons over that way. Ah, there's a little secret chest up yonder. If I time this right. Ah, balls. Come on. Ah, getting stuck. There we go. And up we are! We have fortify strength, a few ingots, another restore health, and a chest! Nice, very nice. Um, yep, take that. Anything else up here? Not that I can see. It's very dark and very dank. Oh, there's another chest. Didn't see that one. Alright, take all those. Jewelry weighs, doesn't weigh much and will do us well at the markets. Okay, what we're going to do is quick save here because you never know what's going to happen. You just never know. Alright, getting back out to third person view. And my system is not liking this place whatsoever. I might have to decrease some of my settings. Open areas make me wary. 
There's a forge there. A few bits and pieces. Aha! Take that. Uh, I, I'm actually starting to get used to this uh, slow down thing. Ah, very nice. I'm getting used to the hang of this whole tank thing. Back in the day, when I used to play World of Warcraft, I used to be a tank. Well, that, well, that was a really demanding job. But, yeah, World of Warcraft has been long past. This is Skyrim now. Alright. Hmm. I am definitely feeling, after this episode, I am going to uh, tool around with my settings to get a better result out of this, because this uh, bit of a slowing down is not nice. Okay, here's a lock. Oh, yep. Very nice, very easy. Cool. Oh, another lock. Is it about the same place? Nah. Not there, not there. Oh. Darn. Come on. It's got to be here somewhere. Ooh, nearly, nearly. Ah, bugger. Try again. No, not there, not there. Um, ooh, there. Okay. Getting closer. Oh, no. There we go. Ooh, a ruby. Gold, lockpick. Ah, necklace, excellent. Um, arrow, I'll take that. Oh, here's another chest. Yes, I have definitely got to do something to my settings. Alright. No, no, not quite. Must be over here. Done. There we go. What's this one? Uh, iron ingots, health, arrows, leave the weapon. Um, not very many interesting things there. And I will take a save. Alright, and then open the door. Hello, is there anybody in here? Hmm. I'll tell you what, folks, I'll be right back and I'll just uh, tweak my settings just a fraction. And we're back again. Oh, that looks a little bit smoother. If not, just a little bit. It looks like a trap there. There was a monster just... Okay, um... Ooh. I'll take that. I shall take that, that's for sure. Um, necklace, take that for sure. Um... Oh, I'll take that. It's not weighing anything. I think um, that could be one of my hacks. Yep. I cheat with some of my games. I really... I'm not really inclined. I like to actually keep all my... Um... Ah, yes. This is much better. If you find that your system is bogging down like mine did, I just turn my uh, anti-aliasing and antroscopic filters down. Just one setting each and it's a, an immediate increase, especially in a place like this. Alright, uh, anything interesting in here? Oh, there's a potion. There's another potion. Alright, let's go. Anything interesting in this area here? No, not that I can see. Thank you, Eleanor, with your light. You light up my world. And that was a really bad lyric. Alright, let's unlock this door, shall we? No, no, ah, oh, come on! I, don't know, I know I suck at lockpicking, but this is ridiculous. There we go. Oh, balls! Yes! Take that! 
<laughs> I'm liking this skilling up. It is very good. Uh, yep, take that, take that. Take those. What else do we have in here? Yep, I'll take those as well. Yes, there's another mod uh, from the Skyrim Nexus called I Don't Give a Pound About Crafting. It just gives me all my crafting uh, materials at zero weight. Sue me. Ooh, that looks actually quite kind of pretty. Alright, uh, gold. Alright. So, if you'd like to keep your crafting materials on you, I'll drop, leave a link down in the uh, description for that actual mod itself because it's, uh, it's handy. It is, it's really handy. Now, I remember there was a passage down this way, so I am going to go down and check it out. And more than likely, it's a dead end. Oh, no, it's not. There happens to be something there. Nice shot, Thema. Nice shot indeed. Alright. Yeah, it was a dead end. <laughs> Silly me. Now. Yes. Much happier with the uh, performance. Much happier indeed. Oh, here's another one of those worker type things. Hello. Yeah, you whack him good. Holy hell. She is a beast. I'm glad she's on my side. Because if she actually took that uh, two handed axe to me, I would not survive. Alright, quick save again. What's down this way? Ah, balls. Pistons that'll push you off. Probably push my companions off too if they're not very careful. Alright, timing, timing. Hey, hey! Actually, I can just jump over these. <laughs> oh, balls. Got stuck. Hey, spider face! Take that! And that! Am I that good or what? Take the ore. Oh, the ladies are fighting something over that way. I'm sure they can uh, cope. They're very competent fighters. Right. And here is a door. Actually, I think this will keep the uh, episodes rather short going through this dungeon, so uh, I'll just do a quick outro here. Just remember, I've been Raytech, this has been Skyrim, Dawnguard Questline. Uh, like the video if you like it, drop a comment down in the comment section if you've got something to say, and if this is the first time viewer of my channel, please subscribe. Um, da daily videos uh, of, any, of varying type um, genres. Um, yeah, Skyrim, Minecraft, Saints Row, pretty much all. I do like um, action adventure games. Alright, till next time.